uh, take food waste, grocery store food that is unsold and starting to go past the expiration date. We take that, we use about a two hour process that mimics human digestion. It's an enzymatic hydrolysis, hydrolysis system. Uh, and it takes all that food waste, breaks it down into its core molecular uh, base particles, and then reforms it as an organic plant food. Man. So that's the source of, of NPK. All use the same dilution rate. All can be used alone or in tandem. But in the end, we've developed this Rev growing protocol, uh, which works great on peppers, but it works on literally anything. And so I've gone from newspaper guy to plant guy very, very quickly. Very nice. Now, a, you know, something that stood out to me, and, and it's a phenomenal thing to hear, always talking about uh, ways that uh, can really cut down because, uh, all right, I guess let, let me back up on that as well. But, uh, you know, as human nature is, we are, you know, not nice as a general society to earth in, in what we're doing and how we're using it and abusing it. Uh, and to be able to, as you're saying, uh, take something that otherwise would have probably just ended up in a landfill, a landfill, uh, yeah. And taking that and being able to repurpose it, put it back to life, put it back in the earth and have that continue to, uh, you know, build up instead of tear down is absolutely amazing. Um, and it sounds like you all have taken quite a few different steps in the overall understanding and the breakdown and the process to this Um I guess, where did the, the inspiration really kind of derive on that aspect? 